Hey guys, before the video starts, I just wanted to let you know that once again, the G Fuel code has been bumped up to 30% off from now through the entire weekend. So if you're looking to try some G Fuel, use code Coogs to save 30% off your entire order. This is probably my favorite episode of Angel in the Outfield every single year. Welcome back to another episode of Angel in the Outfield, ladies and gentlemen. Today, we have the All-Star Game. Every year when we finish up the team, we do an episode where we bring back some of the best players from the series at any point and we build a whole team and play a game with them and this is the team that we ended up with this is the angel in the outfield all-star game team catcher was between two guys it really was between gary sanchez and robinson chirinos as much as i would have loved to have started chirinos right here Gary Sanchez was just too good. He was arguably the second best position player on this entire team when he was there. First base, I could have gone in a lot of ways, but to mix it up with some silvers, golds, all that type of stuff, we started Lomo. Second base, you have to go with Mike Moustakis. This guy was just so friggin' good when he was on the squad. But also, Ryan Sandberg has been great on the squad as well. And the thing is, there weren't really any good shortstops for the squad this year. Mondesi kind of sucked, Trammell sucked, Brandon Crawford kind of sucked, Baez suck and Sandberg's got 68 fielding at shortstop even when you play him out of position so he should be fine there third base I had to get Miguel Sano on this team somewhere and he just kind of fit there so we're going with the tops now version could have started the gold just to you know diversify the silver gold diamond mix and stuff like that but his diamond did perform the best out of any of the Miguel Sano's and in the outfield joining Mike Trout we have the legend Derek Fisher and Jorge Soler on the bench we've got a couple guys Ryan Mountcastle Jared Walsh Marte I used used Marte when he was a gold and then we actually had to take him off the team when he went up to diamond but you know we're still gonna just throw him on here we already said Chirinos and then Pujols Pujols was good when he was a bronze for the pitching side of things our ace 99 Shohei Otani he's been the best starter on the squad for sure some of the other guys we got Steven Matz Lance Lynn Ryan Yarbrough and Brent Honeywell Jr it's kind of tough to build a starting rotation for an all-star game team for Angel in the outfield because most of the guys really only get one start with the rate that we were going with with the upgrades so these are some of the better performers. And I think we got a nice mix of talent in the bullpen. For lefties, we have Gold Jake Diekman, Bronze Garrett Crochet, and Gregory Soto. And for righties, we have Classe Reyes, who's actually pitched the most innings on this squad in the bullpen. Adam Wainwright, Shane Green, and 99 Gossage. So that's the all-star game team. I think we got a good mix of talent on here. Some of the better players from throughout the series. I am going to jump into a game. I am going to play a friendly on Hall of Fame. I'm deep into the legend trenches and rank seasons right now. I really don't feel like playing legend at the moment. So I'm just going to play some Hall of Fame. But down in the comments, since this is the all-star game and a celebration of the series as a whole, let me know what your favorite moment of Angel in the Outfield has been so far this year. This is also not the final episode. We've still got a couple more coming, so don't worry. But I hope you guys enjoyed Enjoy, hit the thumbs up button if you do subscribe to the channel if you're new here and let's go have some fun Ooh, otani versus otani he's got the god squad let's go baby on this angel in the outfield all-star roster i want everybody to pop off this game but if there's you know a couple guys in particular that i really want to see have a crazy game uh, obviously it's got to be Derek fisher i'd like to see moustakis and i'd like to see gary have a crazy game just because those three guys are absolute legends of this series. It was just laid on the fastball, so let's go again. Bang! Back-to-back -back heaters. Okay. Why did I go to anything but a heater after he was just laid on every one? Okay. Back-to-back -back base runners. Come on, Otani. Bear down here. No way he actually hits this. Yeah, no chance. No chance. Derek Fisher! Let's go! He tracks it down. Time to get one of these back. Let's go. Come on, Trouty. Come on, buddy. Find a way to get it through the middle. Oh, I almost swung at that. He had no interest in pitching to Moose. Couldn't hold up there. Sandberg! Get out of here, ball! Come on, bro! Come on! No! Oh, they just teased Sandberg so hard. Splitter low. Shift was perfect. Out of position. It doesn't even matter. I need to see Sandberg field like a legit ground ball, though, like at the shortstop position, not with any shift. There you go, Moose. Because I need to see how Sandberg really plays out of position. 
Dude, that curveball looks so hittable every single time. Oh! <laughs> On 3-2, that was the ninth pitch of the AB, dude. Something about these silver lefties have Otani scared. Can't be looking at that. Gotta pull the trigger. Full count to Fisher. Otani on deck. Derek Fisher. Derek Fisher got Otani. Let's go. He hung a curveball. Yes. Look at Derek Fisher going yard in the Angel in the Outfield All-Star game. This is just pure fate. It was only a matter of time before he hung one of those curveballs because they were all pretty much perfect under the strike zone, but they all look so hittable. So I'm happy I finally got one. Good pitch, good cutter. All right, hey, we got the lead. We made him throw a ton of pitches. He's at about 50 after two. This is good stuff so far. He swung at that? Sandberg, here we go. There we go, Sandberg. Out of position and still throws out Trey Turner. Got Mookie. Yes, he did the damage earlier. That's a big strikeout. There you go, Trout. We're making Otani throw a lot of pitches, a lot of three ball counts. Moose! Oh, that should score Trout with 88 speed. I think he's there all the way. Yep. Mike Moustakis with an RBI double. Derek Fisher already has the two-run bomb. All we need now is Gary, and then all three guys I talked about have popped off. No! What a pitch! 18 speed? Yeah, definitely not enough to go there. Ah! I got one, but I'm not happy with that. Otani's already at 75 pitches over on the other side. So he's probably not going to go too much longer in this game. And when he's at a pitch count like that, I've got to get every run I can before he goes to the bullpen. Because obviously I'm seeing it pretty well. Nice play, Lomo. Nice play. Ooh, Trouty. Nice hit. Huge, huge pop-up. Yes, Scott Schwarber inside cutter works to perfection. So I think his plan is he wants to leave Otani in for at least his next at bat, which I think is in the next inning. After that, he'll probably go ahead and take him off the mound. So we got to get after it right now. Oh no, no, that was the most hanging thing ever. Come on, bro. How am I going to keep missing these pitches that are right in home run locations? No! Give Fisher a little bit more than that on that swing. Come on, game! What? Fastball's still working, man. I got to keep going to that on two strikes. Yeah, don't, don't even try with that one. Just let that one go. Oh my god, don't even try, man! Just stop. All right, is he going to take out Shohei? I think he is pretty much exactly what I expected to happen. Get that at bat and then take him out for Andrew Miller. You see, under it. Oh, wow, this is great. That might have been the easiest inning of all time for him, dude. That was atrocious. Love it. Love the splitter after the fastball in the same location. Inside heater. Let's go. Keep it up, Shohei. Come on. Yeah, man. I am mixing up the speeds way too well. He's struggling. But this is the perfect time for us to get some more runs, man. At any point, he could start to figure it out. And two runs is not the most comfortable lead here. Come on, man. Andrew Miller is not that good. Stop making him look so good. Actually, that Andrew Miller is pretty good. <laughs> Sheesh. My man Sandberg has three flyouts. Oh, dude. If I had a dollar for the amount of bad pitches that I've missed, I could buy every exchange for Team Affinity 4 next week. Let's try the fun pitch. Slider high and away. <laughs> I mean, I could just throw that fastball at any point and it'll work. <laughs> I thought he was about to start showing off with that backhand. That might have been a little too flashy, Shohei. All right, I'm going to take out Lomo. I'm going to start getting some other dudes involved here. Let's go with uh, let's go with Mountcastle. He can play first base. Mountcastle! 
Where's this going? Where's this going? Oh, it's off the wall. Pinch hit double, though, to start the inning. Intentionally walking Solaire to get to Derek Fisher. No, Fisher, no! See, that wouldn't hurt as bad if they actually gave him his freaking home run in his second at bat. 3 2 now. Oh my God. First and second, nobody out. Derek Fisher, man, that double play ruined everything. I'm kind of torn on if I want Shohei to try to go CG because I know he can at this point with how he's pitching, but you know, in the all-star game, you might want to see some more arms in here. You might want to spread the love a little bit. Just going to go high and in. We'll challenge him. And he's gone. Oh, let's go, Moustakis. What a play. Got him. 14 strikeouts with Otani. That's nuts. Oh, he had Jared Walsh on the mound. He should have just pitched with him. Run, Mike. Dang, man. Moustakis is in. Once again, we're going to spread it around a little bit. We're going to go Marte, and Marte can play second. And that's going to do nothing. All right, as much as I want Gary to hit, we're going to give uh, Robinson Chirinos a chance right here against the lefty. And it might have worked. No, that's staying up for Clemente. <laughs> Wait, did that go off his head? Clemente just wore this off the dome, bro. Under that. Wow, bro. Another missed slider. This goes against everything I know, but I'm going to take out Otani. I know it's not a shutout, so there's no complete game shutout in line there, but... This is the all-star game. I want to see some more arms in here. Reyes has thrown the most innings out of the bullpen for me out of anybody in this series. So I think it's right to let him close it out here. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait a minute. We got to actually get this going here. All right. Got Trout. Just got to get Cabrera now. Good pitch. All right. Two strikes. I'm going to try to get him expand on the slider away. Ooh, good take. Take that out at second. Let's go. The Angel in the outfield all-star squad gets the W. Reyes gets the save. An absolutely electric performance from Shohei Otani. He struck out 14, only allowed one, and that was the second batter of the game. After that, it was next to perfect. I think you got to give offensive MVP of this game to Derek Fisher. I mean, he drove in two on that home run, and that ended up being the difference in the final score. So Shohei Otani and Derek Fisher lead the Angel in the outfield all-star squad to a victory today. We didn't do as great with the offense as I would have hoped when we got four hits, but hey, we got the dub. And it was nice to see a team like this just to highlight some of the best players that the series has seen so far. Anyway, that's going to do it for the Angel in the Outfield All-Star Game. This is not the final episode of the series. We still have two more before the series is finally over. So I hope you guys are having fun with it. If you have enjoyed it, hit the thumbs up button. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.